Kenna came up with the term working class and uh, it really stuck with me and it threads the needle. It's not really about how much harder you work, how many hours you work, what your job is, while you also decide to pursue a passion like bike racing, or in this case, cyclocross on the side, you know. It's not about highlighting how much you work and how much you suffer. That's, that doesn't, who cares? Like, we all have, everything's hard for everybody. It doesn't matter what your life is, you know. We're all challenged all day long by the simplest things, the hard things. That doesn't matter. It, we're not trying to compare ourselves to anybody else, and we're not the only ones who do this, not by a long shot. Let's not compare this to where we come from, but to where we're going. My riders, my team, fancy themselves professionals in a very true sense because their peer group are the very best. There's no excuse. It doesn't matter to me at all that Clara has to work part-time to full-time in order to help make this reality. It doesn't matter to me at all that Beth Ann has to do the same thing. None of that really matters. What matters is that they're trying to be the best against the very best. And given that we balance that with sort of a work life, it's apt to call it working class. There's a lot going on with the sport of cyclocross. Uh, it doesn't make any sense. Why would you ride skinny tires that are ill-equipped to navigate the terrain at really high speeds? Yeah. <laughs> uh, there's something really very perfect and oddly pure about it that attracts a lot of people. The sport itself just lends working class to the description. <laughs> it is very ugly in workaday to get through a cyclocross race. The great thing about cyclocross is, is how like literally and figuratively messy it is. When you're racing cyclocross, the last thing you want to do is lose your momentum. You always need to be moving forward. I don't care what just happened to you on the cyclocross course. I could care less that somebody crashed in front of you. I don't care if you got a flat tire out there. Flat tire means you better start riding your bike faster. That's part of cyclocross, getting a flat tire, having a bad thing happen, having somebody else crash you out. You gotta click past it, no emotional investment to it. So you fell down and your bars are 40 degrees to the left. You better start riding real fast to get your other bike out of the pit if you got one in there. To me, that's very working class. It means just get the job done, and everything about cyclocross is just get the job done. <laughs> <laughs>